Hey y'all, what's up? Welcome back. All right, so this video is crazy. <laughs> I ordered a ton of stuff from Timu. I guess you would have seen by the thumbnail. I'm gonna try to hold up this box and do a thumbnail, but this is crazy. I'm not sure if my orders got like put together or what happened. I did order quite a bit of stuff and then I ordered my own order so I could see how it kind of works with um, Timu and my girlfriend. She ordered an order too, so we can kind of see how long it takes. Um, is it any different from me ordering than me actually working with the company and all that good stuff, right? Then I just had a hunch that a lot of the things that we see on Timu at these like very cheap, affordable prices are some of the same things we kind of see like on uh, Amazon and AliExpress and all them. Y'all. OK, so I, I don't know if my orders got mixed up together or what really happened, but it's a ton of stuff in here. And I know good and well, I didn't order this much stuff. So um and it looks like there's some duplicates in here, which I'm not complaining, but yeah, let's go ahead and get into it. And I can tell you what I think about these items because it's a lot. All right. So if you're new to the channel, welcome to the channel, honey. My name is Helen and um, we do all the things over here and I love to review products and companies, especially um, companies that have taken off like Timu and everybody's talking about them. And I just want to be one of those ones to give you like the real tea. All right. I'm working with them. Don't get me wrong. But you still know you're going to get the real tea over here. So I ordered a bunch of stuff, random, random stuff. Most of it has to do with either like the kitchen or anything like gardening. So there were a few things I already opened because it came separate. Um, I would say about two weeks it took for me to get some of these items. I don't even really think it took two weeks. I would say like seven, eight days. What happened was I'm working with them. So they had to approve the items then um, have the shipping sent out to me. That whole process took like two weeks. My personal order took like six or seven days. Crazy. All right. So random stuff. I'm going to show you everything that you would kind of see online. So you'll know if you're interested. I don't remember all the prices, but everything was either one, two, three dollars. <laughs> Very cheap. All right. So I ordered this little bag right here just to have, I wanted something to put my fruit and stuff in when I'm going to the gym. It is a insulated bag. I'm uh, really cute. It's just called, um, uh, I think it's called bento bag, something like that. Let me show you what the handles look like. That's what the handles look like. So it's really good material. I can definitely fit my, um, uh, my little lunch kit in here, my fruits when I come out to the gym, I can eat instead of being Y'all know. Y'all know how it goes. All right. So we're not going to talk too much about this stuff because it's a lot. Hold on. I'm missing something. All right. So when we mop the floor at night, I like to add peppermint oil to my uh, soap. But I've been using dish tabs. I saw like the little thing on that was trending on TikTok like a long time ago, but sometime last year. And I started using them. Well, I didn't want to spend all the money on them. So I saw some on T-Moon was like, well, what they look like? Let me just get a small pack and see. Do they work? Girl, these things are strong in scent. Very, like, really good scent. Look at this big old bag. We didn't need that for this. Uh, but these are dish tabs. This is what they look like. Just like your regular dish tab or whatever. Now, I haven't used these on my dishes, but we've been putting them in, our, in my mop water. It might have been a dollar for, like, eight or nine of these, ten, ten of these little tabs because we've been using them and my water's filthy. So I know they're cleaning. They're actually working because they, you can see the water being dirty, right? But girl, yeah, I don't know. We're going to keep using them. I just don't know about the dishes, but to put in the mop water, I do like their dish tabs. Now, I don't know if I can link all this stuff. I'll try to just, I'll link Timu, any discounts, anything that they have, I can find for you all. But when it comes to actually linking each product, I think it's going to be extremely hard, but I'll try to link as much as I can. Because I bought random stuff. Random stuff such as this. This is the cups that you use for like baking. Um, every, everything that was like a dollar, I was like, well, let me see. Well, let me see. Like, should I just order a bunch of these or stick with like the stuff I buy when I'm in store with, um, home goods and whatnot. So, oh, these are very thin. So these are definitely the ones you use after you've baked your goods and you just want to decorate with the uh, paper. I wouldn't actually, well, no, I guess I could put this in the oven. I don't know, but these are cute. I like these. I have to say, I do like these. They are cute and thin and you just put your little 
muffins in them. So I would have to say I do like this. It was a dollar. So I definitely think this is worth it. Um, I don't know how many is in here. It looks like it's at least 12. It just says um, tulip cup. It says tulip cake paper cup. And it doesn't tell me. And its color is natural. But it didn't tell me how many is in here. So, uh, yeah. Well, they just sent me stuff. Because I, I was thinking there's no way I could have ordered all this stuff. All right, so this is a, looks like a facial, um, this video is going to be so long. Y'all need to get you a snack. Get you a snack because I'm going to try to show y'all in detail what this stuff looks like. I don't want you ordering stuff and you don't like it. So it's very soft like this, very soft, and you put your hand in it from the back like this. So a nice buffing. I don't know if this is for you or for the car. Yeah, I don't know what this is. I, I don't know what none of this stuff is. This is um, Danger of Suffocation Gray. I don't know what this is. It, oh, I know what this is. Never mind. Yes, I do. All right, so these were like $2, if $2, a dollar something. And this is the thing um, I slide underneath my door. I know exactly what this is. So this is that thing. You see this? You see this opening part right here? You slide underneath your door and your door is like this so that you cut it to size. That way you don't get any air or drafting or heat or whatever you want to protect from your door. So this stamp is thin enough. You see that? And then this. I know exactly what this is. I needed this when it was extremely cold. So I'm glad I got it. It was like a dollar or something, y'all. It's crazy. Um, I picked up some exfoliating cleaning gloves. These are probably like maybe under a dollar, if a dollar. So these look like it's the same gloves. These are the same gloves. These are actually thicker than the ones I get from <laughs> TJ Maxx. I have to wash all this stuff. All this is random, just so you know. I picked this up. This is a, um, is it like mandolin? No, no, mandolin is the other one. This is like a grater. So if you want to do like um, zest of something, I picked this up. I do remember this. Pick this up. This is just random for the kids' bathrooms. This is just one of those sponges that you see, like probably in a dollar store. Um, it's quite rough too. This is quite rough. So I picked this up so they can have this for the tub. Bag is just full of stuff. I, I'm just, I'm almost overwhelmed. This is, and it doesn't say what it is on the thing. This says wooden hot pop. Okay, these are chopsticks. So these are chopsticks. So you know how sometimes I'm making my um, stir fry and I'm always using chopsticks when I make my stir fry except they're short. So these are the longer ones and I've been wanting these and these were like a dollar or something a set. It's crazy. Ordering more of those for sure. This right here is, um, these are sleeves. So I was lucky enough to receive um, through one of you all, a couple of you all, some beautiful uh, like gloves for the garden. But um, for like the rose bushes, for when I'm sticking my arms and like the uh, squash and all that, I wanted the sleeves. So here are the sleeves. You literally just put your arm through here, um, your thumb and your hand out or whatever when you have your gloves. And this will protect you from all that sticky pokey that you get when you're... Um, this and those leaves on squash and zucchini, girl, will irritate you as well as the ones for cucumbers. I used to have whips all over me, so this is perfect for that. I hope I'm not moving too much for this microphone. Um, this right here. Oh, these are so cute. <laughs> these are so cute. Okay, so these are the little flower spoons. Um, yeah, this is, this is so cute. I wanted these cute little teaspoons. Oh, you get four in a set? I got four in a set. They might have been $2, y'all. I'm telling you, everything was like ridiculously cheap. Okay, so these are all flowers. Oh, my goodness. And a heart. Let me hold this up for y'all so y'all can see. This is so cute. Have a little, you know, like me and the girls chilling at like a little tea party. Look how cute these are. These are so cute. And they're, they're spoons. Yeah, these are cute. Love it, love it, love it. All right, is that empty? I don't know why I have tape. Clear caulk shape. Oh, I didn't know they came in clear. I thought it was regular, so I need to re caulk around the girl's tub. Oh, it's sticky too. So, this is caulking tape. So, oh, we're gonna try this. I'll let you know what I think. 
Oh, it's thick. Look. Oh, yeah. Okay. I'm going to use that. I know what this is, but I, I in my mind, I'm like, huh? Because I think they sent me two. Y'all have to pick up all that mess I'm throwing over here. This is for like your soap. So you know how your soap will sometimes be a little... I use black soap on my face, right? So um, am I supposed to pop it in? I think I'm supposed to pop it in. I'm sorry. Hold on, y'all. All right. So you know how <laughs> this looks like some else. <laughs> You know, you put your soap right here and then that way it can kind of like drain. So that's what this is. This is a soap holder. Cute for the side of your tub. They had them in white, gray, black. They had them in several colors, but they're just a soap holder. That's all that is. And yeah, so this is cute. I like this. This is, I don't even think it was a dollar. I think it was under a dollar. Here's another bag. I don't think we can get through all this. I don't even know if we can get through all this. Ain't no way. Yeah, see, I think they sent me stuff on accident more than one, but that's okay. I'm going to use the same little soap dispenser in the girls' bathroom, too. So they'll have one. I'll have one um, in regards to the soap. Oh, I needed these. So these are wheels. So you know how sometimes we'll get, like, little mop buckets and we'll get, like, stuff like that that does not come with wheels. Where these are the wheels. They come with, like, this 3M, like, double-sided. You're going to stick it on to the actual wheel and then these are wheels you could put these on mop buckets or whatever and i thought these were cute for a little pack they were really cheap um too how many come in here i keep saying they were really cheap they're, everything was cheap so i'm definitely going to put this on my um my mop bucket matches my mop bucket too so it has four in here i needed this <laughs> I kept saying when I travel, I got that little skinny thing, but I wanted uh, one of these that you put your, um, here's a string, that you put your toothbrush and toothpaste in. I see these on Amazon all the time, like five and six bucks, but I think this was under a dollar. So I just picked up one of these just to see the quality of it. And um, now that I see the quality of it, I'll go ahead and order everybody one. So when we're traveling, they can have their own um, for sure. And that way, when you you know when you leave your stuff in the bathroom, it's actually in a container instead of leaving it like on a shelf with just the top part is covered. The all, everything is covered: your toothpaste and your toothbrush. So, um, this is solar string lights outdoors. Okay, so this has like this little solar um, panel, looks like a solar panel, and then some string lights. How many feet is this? This one was actually longer. I think this is like five or six bucks. This one just says, um, says the voltage and the wattage, but I don't see how long that is. Anyway, you'll see it because I'm surely going to put this outside. So I got it for um, this. I've been wanting these, but um, they weren't as cheap as they were on Timu. <laughs> uh yeah so these are the liners these are the liners for like messy things like when we're doing like the kids wings and the buffalo mushrooms right these are the paper liners that go into your air fryer take them out and you trash them so i'm gonna throw that one away since i touched it my hands are dirty right now from touching all this so i picked these up they had the larger ones the small ones so kind of know what size your air fryer is before you order these because i did order the larger ones it just says fried pan paper plates <laughs> but um yeah these are for air fryers so i like that right and they were cheap <laughs> stop saying that all right so i got another solar light the solar light that is by my fence is out these were very inexpensive as well. Um, Y'all know I use these outside to light up my entire backyard. So they had these. It looks like the same ones I bought from Amazon. Pretty much the same. I don't remember how much these are, but definitely look them up online. But I thought they were a really good price. I, I didn't pay over $5 for anything. I, I want to say I didn't pay over 3 $4 for anything. But something in here I might have. Um, and then some stuff they might have sent me. Because like I said, I ordered some stuff. Plus, they sent me some stuff. Um, yeah, I needed another one of these. 
when you're using the butter is it like this is it bent oh no it's just me when, you, when you're using the butter for like your biscuits or whatever you're doing or egg washes whatever right i don't have an, i don't have one currently and i just want a little cute one and they were cheap 50 cent probably and all this i promise i don't remember ordering all this unless it came in a set and i just don't remember but um what is this so this one I don't even know how to use this. This is what it looks like. Yeah, I don't even know how to use this. But I'm sure you scrape something off. I don't know. Uh, I'm gonna put it over here. All right, so this is some more three inch strip something. Oh, this is, okay. This is another one of those things on the on uh, line that were like four and five bucks. I really don't remember. It comes with three M strip. Let me show you. 3M strip, right? And this is, it looks just like this. And you just hang it on the wall and your um, your razor sits here. So I've been wanting, wanting one of these. So yeah, got one of these, you see? And it's metal, like, um, it's heavy metal. So now that I know it's good quality for $1.19, whatever it was, I ordered the girls a couple of these too. So I placed some gloves on my wishes for um, for the garden, and I figured I would order them. But of course, someone ordered them for me uh, before I could order them. So um, I knew I didn't want to mess those up. Those were going to be my flower gloves. So I wanted some dirt digging gloves, and I saw these. And of course, I've seen these online everywhere. Uh, but they were like, I don't know, five, six, seven dollars a pair, or whatever they were. And they, I would say they were like two or three dollars for these, maybe two. Uh, but these are the ones where you take like your claws and dig in the dirt with. So here is a pair. And this is what I mean when I say I think they sent me too much or something happened. Because here's another pair, which we're all out in the garden. So we definitely need more than one pair of gloves. And um, here's two more pairs. So I might have ordered a set of two. And then I might have got a set of two through uh, Timu with working with them, collaborating them. So I think that may be why I have so many, but um, which is not bad because I could just put these in the container in the shed out. So if something happened to mine that go bad, I break one, you got some more. Because we always digging in the dirt. Now, one thing I do see that I'm kind of like bummed about, but I'll just use these for outdoors, like the car, uh, the garage when we wipe down our equipment and for um like the furniture outside are these sponges i really want these sponges to be on point but they are stained i don't know if you can see that they're like they have like little yellowness on them yeah i opened these yesterday thinking i was going to use them immediately for something and um, i don't know why it looks like that so they would definitely be used for outdoors i'm not going to throw them away um because we always wipe them down like those uh, outdoor plant pots or furniture and like I said the car and stuff yeah so it does have like a scratchy side on one side and like a smooth spongy side on others perfect for your wheels and stuff like that so this whole pack might have been two dollars so that's why I figured why not um y'all it's so much stuff left so if you want to take a break just pause me <laughs> I'm just saying I'll still be here. Oh, okay. So this is, this is a different size. So I got this size and this size. So maybe I don't need another long one, but I like these too. Yeah, I like these too. I like this length. I don't like sh short chopsticks. I don't know why, but I'm um, glad I got those. Don't remember getting those, but I'm glad. Picked up one of these, these big ladles. Picked up one of these, especially when I'm doing like the, um, what do you call that? Uh, f not pho, like pho, and I want to get the pieces out, like the cinnamon stuff, or what I'm doing. Um, oh, I can't think. My mind just went blank. But anyway, I needed one of these. This is heavy. Okay. Got one of these. Got one of these. It's a fun gadget to have. I've never had one of these before. I see people use them all the time on TikTok and you put it inside your pepper and pop that seed part out. So you put it down, take this part and shoot. So it's just a gadget. This is just, it probably was 50 cent. It's sharp though. 
Ooh, child. I feel like I'm just going on and on. I don't even know what this is and why. Oh, okay. So I got a whole bag of these. Probably thought it was just one. But this is what it looks like. And you just put them into your bottles and for your um, oils or whatever. So I want to get a couple of bottles. And every time I see bottles like this, sometimes they're like Ross and they don't have the top. And I was like, oh, I just ordered some of these tops, like a dollar or two in color day. And it's a lot in here, like six. So I should be good on that. I wanted some more of these. Summer is here. So I'm sure they'll be having all kind of fun foods and whatever. I want to say these came in like three sizes, these bottles right here. But these are the, um, there's some regular bottles like this, like condiment bottles. So, um, yeah, I wanted these for like summer. We're always making and doing something, but I just want some condiment bottles for all the like either the oils when we make like salad dressings and whatever. Since I'm growing a lot of herbs this year, I'll be playing with a lot of stuff like that. So I just got like these little condiment bottles instead of using all those glasses. Um, and they're just temporary. I want to say they said BPA free. I want to say it said that on there. I have to go back and look, but, um, does it say it on here? It's nothing's going to say it on here. But I want to say it said that. It just says kitchen utensils. I know that's what other thing. All right. All right. Some more of these. Now, listen. I saw these in store. Like a set like this. Like, I don't know if it was home goods or what it was. Something like that. And they were like, I don't know, six bucks for that pack. It's like a little pack, a little... And they had these cute little wooden utensils. And this is what it is. So it is the wooden spoon, the fork, and the um, the, the chopsticks. So it has like this threading on the end like this. All these are cute. So I, I'm all things wood. Right? This wood bowls is just, they had so many wood bowls on Timu and platters. I was like. But this is cute. So I'll definitely be ordering some more of these. A couple of set of those. Because I know if I like them, they will like them. There is so much stuff in here. So much stuff. Oh, this is cool. So this is a safe cook utensil. So it looks like this. Just a little metal. But you put your, your hand like this to hold it. No, I'm going to do it like this. You put your hand like this. And then you chop. I'm going to be practicing too. I actually download an app that shows you how to chop like different vegetables and whatever, fruits and stuff. So I'm going to be practicing. Garlic peeling apparatus. I don't know what this is. I don't know what this is. I didn't order this. I don't know. I don't know about this. All right. So yeah, I don't know. It's like a little, I don't know. Oh, this is tiny. All right. So they had a ton of these online and I wasn't sure the sizes. Okay. So just, <laughs> and um, this is little. So this is the one that was probably like under a dollar. So it's a mini strainer. I guess I could put this on top of my jars because my jars are this size. And if I want to just, you know, pour a little something in, like when I do my grapefruit juice or something, but I bring it out the big strainer. So I'll still be able to use it, but it's smaller than what I thought. So I need to go back online and order the big one. I needed these. I wanted to make sure they were durable enough before I purchase a bunch of these. I will be going back online and ordering these today. So hopefully they'll come in quick. So you take the back and you stick it onto an appliance like Martha, what's uh, the kitchen aid, or like your um, whatever. You, and then you take your cords and wrap it and wrap it, and then you lock the end piece right here. So I wanted these, and I want to say two in a pack were for a dollar. So I got these. Um, this is a lot. All right, so I did get this mesh strainer. This is like when you're juicing stuff like watermelon, stuff you need to squeeze, right? Not just a regular strainer. Almost like a nut bag strainer. That's what this one is. So that's why I picked up this one. It's like a nut bag strainer. And it's easy to get everything out in this. So this is actually a heavy plastic. It's not thin. It's actually really thick. So like that. I'm definitely gonna baby use that. Now I just bought this from <laughs> I just bought one of these from Target, right? Yeah. Anyway. Well, no, it's not the same. It's different. 
Definitely not the same. Do they open? Oh, it does open. Okay. Yeah. So this is fine. We can just have this sitting when we have fruit. When we take the fruit out and we want it to strain and like whatever, we can just sit it here in the basket a little bit while we're working on other stuff when we were prepping. So I just wanted to pick up one and I wanted to see how good it was. And it's pretty thick. So it's not thin at all. So if you see these for like $2, they really are pretty much thick. So yeah, got this one. And I got gray. I think they had like white too. So it is a little bit different than the one I bought. I'm still going. Let me get closer to y'all. I try to get comfortable so I would be comfortable doing this video. But I, I, don't, I don't think I realize how much little stuff is in here. So what are these? See, these are the ones I need to make sure they're BPA free. These are the ones I was really wondering about. So I got two of these. This is what it looks like. And um, I would like for them to be glass. So you have little holes right here. And you just like mayonnaise, how you squeeze them out like this. I like these. I really like bottles like these. My only problem is making sure they're BPA free because I want the baby to squeeze them. I don't want the glass for like um, the mayo. I want the baby to squeeze it. So um, yeah, we have two of these. So we'll see how it goes when, once I look them up. But I don't remember seeing that. All right. So I only got one of these just to see how flimsy it was for the tacos. So I think we had the metal ones too. Um, they go in the oven down there. But yeah, I thought this would be fun. I thought, Let me just see. So there it is. That's what it looks like. I'm only here to show you. So I actually got more of those bottles. They're like baby bottles, right? I'm just wondering over time when they're going to break this piece. I mean, it's less than a dollar. All right. So, oh, okay. So I ordered this. Something else that's random, but I'll use it. So it comes like this. These little two pieces. Lock them together. And my planners that are outside that are on the ground, I want to raise them. That's why I want that raised shelf. But the ones that are a little bit larger, I could just set them on here. It's like wood. So I'll definitely be ordering more of these because they were said with me cheap. <laughs> they were cheap, girl. All right, I needed another sharpener. Uh, this is just a knife sharpener. Let me show you what it looks like. It looks like really good quality, actually. Yeah, that's what it looks like. Yep, like this. I like that it has the at the bottom and right here. So when you sit it down, it doesn't slide on your counter. Yes, yeah, so that's what this looks like. So I got a knife sharpener. So all this stuff was like $120. Just so you know, all this stuff was like $120. All right, so we picked up some of these. Let me tell you what these are. If you have uh, like a lot of hair in your house, like either wigs, weave, or just naturally a lot of hair. Um, sometimes it'll get in your dryer and sometimes you'll see it like stick and poke on like towels and stuff. So these are supposed to collect lint and hair. These little spongy like things in your dryer as your clothes dry. So I got a set of three. I will be trying them out and let you know what I think about them. But um, yeah, it happens to us all the time. My girls have tons of hair. Um, it's called a washing ball. Anyway, I got little animals on it. But I think it was supposed to get animal hair, is what it says on there. Like, if you have, like, animals that shed or whatever. But we got humans that shed, okay? All right, so some more of the... Oh, this is another one. All right, so this is the silicone version of those papers. So for those of you who don't want to be wasteful and don't want to use the papers, I'm just going to toss them in trash to be honest um silicone might be your option so i don't know how it heats up in the air fryer i've never really tried silicone air fryer so i thought I'd, let me try it first and then i'll let y'all know what i think but here is the silicone basket and if it works we'll just be using this to use for all of our messes okay because they like to put hot sauce on french fries everything in an air fryer oh girl somebody got a lot of dishes to wash so I picked this cup up because it's very popular. Everybody likes to order these cups. It's always on that, you know, on those videos. 
Absolutely nothing. Absolutely nothing. I've had one of these and I have the bigger one right now. So yeah, it has the straw. Come on, look at this. I think this is stickers. Yeah, it has cute little stickers in here. We don't need stickers. So this one has um, 32 ounces. It has a little thing and it has the time stamps on it. For what time? Like as a reminder, blah, blah. Almost done. Don't give up. Keep checking. Remember your goal. Get started. So, yeah. I think this was like a dollar, maybe two dollars cheaper than what I would have normally found. Okay. So that's why I was like, well, let me see what it looks like. So that's what it looks like. So if you saw these online and you were wondering, and they had other colors too. So you can have the option of, there you go. Yep. And it's a straw in there. All right. Okay, so this is a thing that's um, supposed to cut watermelon. This is what it looks like. It's supposed to be able to take it and cut down the grooves and then pop it out like chunks. I know I'm going to use my knife. Girl, this thing is heavy and sharp. And you're supposed to take it and do this, right? And as it does this, it's cutting each layer. And then do it this way. Do it that way. And we about to, listen, I'm about to be gadget out. I know somebody's like, what the heck? Girl, look at all this. They gotta come help me too. They're gonna have an attitude. All right. Um, it's a lot of plastic though. It, this is a lot of plastic. This is a, a lot of plastic. Unnecessary, but I think it's because each item is packed separately. They don't know if, what you're gonna order, right? And this is another one. Okay, so this is the one that's made like this. So you put this on the back, the sticky part. This is the side. So you're going to wrap the cords around, right? And then the cord will stop right here. So the cords will wrap around. And then this is how this one's heavy, like heavy, heavy. So if you have something large with cords, this is like a heavier, heavier one than the other ones. So look up these things online, cord wrappers. And there's another one on bottles. Um, here is a, a, this is, this is, I don't know about this. Hold on. So, so far the sponges and that little garlic peel thing are the only two things I'm like, no, no. Okay. Um, this right here is for the sink. So does it go this way? I think you just put it in the sink like this, like a strainer or whatever. Nothing to it. Just sit it there so that when I'm rinsing out the stuff with pulp, I can catch it. These bags. I'm going to keep these bags. <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to do with them, but I'm going to keep these bags. <sighs> okay, so I ordered one of these. We'll see how this works, too. I'll plug up my uh, phone to it today. But this is just your USB charger. That's what it looks like. The blocks. We always need those, so... And this is, it feel like chopsticks. I hope it's the metal ones. I saw some metal ones on there, but I don't remember ordering. Nope, it's not. These are these. So I don't know if they sent them to me twice or if I ordered them twice. But um, yeah, it's going to be nice to be able to use these while I'm cooking and that steam is not burning my hands. Yeah, this is... <sighs> I picked up a mitten. I think at this time, at this point, I just need to add something to get to the total. So I just picked up a mitten. It doesn't feel like it's thick enough not to get too hot. I don't know. I don't know. I thought I would go in my kitchen too. So, oh, last bag. So I did get one of these. I saw these online and I wanted to try it, but now that I see it, it's a little flimsy. You put the batter in there and you squeeze like this. And it's supposed to, um, yeah, I don't know about this one. All right, so this is the hole like this, but when you squeeze it, it opens up the hole and let the batter out. And it's supposed to be for like pancakes, perfect circles. But I do perfect circles with just my measuring cup, but I thought I'd see what it looked like. Now y'all know what it looked like, and it's a, it's a no. But though, maybe it worked different if it's actually batter in it, like to keep it heavy. I don't know. This is a, on here it says coaster. 
but it's ready for your pots like a cute little would you sit your warm or hot pot or just anything on i thought this was cute so i like this it almost feels like silicone i like this i wanted one of these for when i'm doing like small seeds like carrots lettuce and stuff like that outside in the garden it's in here and it has this big old hole see that hole right there but you can change the size of the hole to a little bit smaller you're not gonna be able to see it all right oh this is perfect timing i was going to store to get these today uh these are the uh, plant ties i need these right now for my tomatoes you just twisty tie um, your stems onto the boards, your steaks or whatever. I need these right now. Perfect. All right, so here are some microfiber cloths. Oh, girl, you know the inside of my car has that like TV screen and I'm continuously wiping it. This is perfect for that. Look how thick this tile is. Oh, this is perfect. I like this the top. Okay, okay. This is a um, solar light. This is solar for the sun. It's a light up top. It's a light at the bottom. You screw it in like this, like on something. I don't know why I have this. Yeah. But I have it. So there it is. And I'm going to use it. Oh, this is so cute. Thing for the ground. <laughs> Definitely. So this is like the little plate. And this is the teapot for my tea. Oh my god, this is so cute! Oh my goodness, <laughs> we're gonna wash that in a few minutes. We're gonna use that, okay? That brought me joy. Dry sweeping cloths. I needed some of these. I use these underneath my bed. I told y'all before, for some reason, underneath our beds get really dusty with that fake wood floor. So, we use these on the Swiffer all the time. So, these are really cheap. If these work, I'm definitely buying more. Here go another one. You know, we used to buy these things that look like this for you to TTE in when you were going camping. That's what this looks like, but it's, that's not what it is. Um, I got some piping for our windows um, for like to keep the heat out and winter out, whatever. I like to redo this every so often. So I got that. Oh my God. <laughs> Last but not least, girl, I forgot all about these. Um, I'm going to have to get these to Penny so she can go do this. These are my covers for my pillows out front. Y'all know we like to switch them out. I don't like to buy pillows. I just switch out the covers. And these are huge. These are freaking huge. Look how cute this is. Oh, this is so cute. It says Happy Easter. It says Bless Our Nest. So cute. Um... What does it say? Easter? Why does it say Easter? How do I pick Easter? Happy Easter. It's cute. We can leave it out for spring. And Easter egg. This one has a stain on it. I don't know why. But these are cute. Oh, these are so cute. I don't even remember. I remember ordering some pillow covers, but I, by the time... Okay, that's it. That's everything. I'm going to go ahead and let y'all go so we can go ahead and clean up this mess. It's huge. Um, but thanks for hanging out with me. Let me know what you think about Timu. Have you ordered from him? Have you been like uh, binge watching these Timu hauls like I have? I've been trying to see what all do they have. The website is very... Um, like it's busy. It's a lot. Like you need to go in categories or you need to know what you're looking for because you'll literally go down a rabbit hole because you'll click something and at the bottom it suggests more and you just keep going and keep going. So if you are interested in shopping Timo, just make sure you read some of the uh, reviews as well. Remember, it is still a new a newer site. And um, yeah, let me know your thoughts. For me, I would say um, eight out of 10. I mean, everything I ordered, I kind of figure like, mm, I don't know kind of gimmicky some stuff is probably i'm really going to use every day some stuff i just want to see what it looked like in order to order more love my chopsticks love my little tea kettle i love these little solar lights i'm like it's the same stuff i've been ordering but i've been paying more now granted i don't get it next day okay or two days but um stuff you order from timu you don't mind waiting for you order now and it's for stuff to stock up so i plan on stocking my pantry 
um, with a few things. All my cleaning supply cabinets. That's why I wanted to see what the sponges look like. I am going to get the white sponges. I've heard really good things about those that look like the Mr. Clean ones or whatever. Because we use them a lot when cleaning. So I plan on stocking that kind of stuff. The sponges, the cleaning utensils, all that. I don't know about supplies, um, uh, like as in like the sprays. I'm probably not going to get anything like that. But um, I did order those dish tasks, like I told you, just to see what it looks like in the mop water. It bubbled and everything. So I was like, okay. But um, yeah, that's it. I don't know what else to say. That's it. Timu. <laughs> I'm shocked too. Like I got a lot of stuff. Hope you had a snack and a little drink. Okay. Shout out to Timu for collaborating with me on this video. I do appreciate you. Um, We'll definitely keep shopping. My girlfriend bought a ton of stuff for an upcoming a event. The Mahler balloons were beautiful. The um, like party favor stuff was on point. And she actually got, uh, she got a lot. She got a lot for what she paid for, I should say. And those balloons can be really expensive. You already know. And you get to pay to blow them up. So she did really good. She made out great on her order. And check out their coupons and the discounts. And once you order something, they'll come back with another discount. Okay. They'll say, spend this and you get $20 off. You know how it go. See you on the next one. Thanks for hanging out with me today. Peace and blessings.